Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 2177, where we have 30 moves to collect 200,000 points. We've got a lot going on on this board. We've got these cake bombs. If I could get rid of them, they would clear out a lot of space for me, so that would be nice. I've got mystery candy dispensers. Could be good, could be evil. When I get the mystery candies down, I want to try to pull them away from the dispensers so that if they are five-layer thick frosting, I don't have to deal with them. And then I also have these ticking time bomb dispensers. Now, the time bombs are set at 10. So I don't want to open them up right away, but if I'm going for points, and I do have to go for points, the best way to get points is to match a color bomb with the color of the most prevalent ticking time bomb on the board. So it'd be nice if I could make some color bombs first and get to around, to around 10 points and then open this up. We'll just have to wait and see what happens. Sometimes I'm relegated to certain moves that I don't even want just because that's what's available on the board at the time. Here we go. I've got a color bomb. That looks pretty nice. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and do this. We've got 19. I'm going to open that up right under. Oh, funny. Well, it's a ticking time bomb. Let's see. Ah, another ticking time bomb, which is kind of funny and not horrible because I do need ticking time bombs, but probably just not those. Ah, oh, stink. That sent off in the wrong direction. It's going to get this no matter what. I just wanted to wait and use the color bomb differently. Thankfully, I got another color bomb out of all of that. Okay, and now nothing can hurt me up here because of uh, the fact that I don't have enough moves left for them to hurt me, but that means that I've got to do some quick work here. Oy. I liked all of those time bombs I had earlier. Look at this, I can't even get the color I need. Here we go. I think this is going to work for me. Uh, even though I didn't get everything yet, I do get points for everything I have on the board created and not yet collected. So I'm going to get some bonus points here. As things clear out, I'll get some cascades and extra points that'll happen. There we go. So we got it. And that was just my second playthrough for recording purposes. Although I have to say this one is a nail biter to me. You just never know what's going to happen and how you're going to get there. Because you've got mystery candies on the board and anytime you have mystery candies, it's a bit of a gamble. If you'd like to see more videos, you can subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. And as always, thanks for watching.